What's going on everyone? Tim aka Jumble Junkie back with another arcade review from ACAM. So today we're going to be taking a look at the controversial Death Race. Death Race was made in 1976 by a company called Exidy. What is Death Race? Well, this is like the 1970s version of Grand Theft Auto. You play as a Grim Reaper in his muscle car where you must run over these gremlins, putting them back where they belong. Death Race was actually based and inspired by the Sly movie Death Race 2000. Why so controversial, you may ask? I mean, look at the black and white blood and gore. All joking aside, running over stick figure gremlins in the 70s was crossing the line, apparently. This game quickly became banned, and not many survived, unfortunately. But fortunately, the American Classic Arcade Museum at Funspot has a very special death race. Traditionally, the death race cab came in black or white. ACAM is yellow. Little is known about this yellow cab's origin, but when this game arrived at ACAM, it was smelly, waterlogged, and falling apart. Gary and the crew did an amazing job completely restoring it, keeping its unique yellow color. This cab has a fantastic and unique look to it for sure. The marquee is more like a pinball bat glass with great illustrations of the Reapers burning rubber in the graveyard. Not to mention the whole cabinet art is amazing. As basic as running over gremlin sound, the gameplay on this game for 1976 is fantastic. It may look very simplistic, but there's actually an art and a skill to running over as many gremlins as you can before the timer runs out. The control panels have steering wheels and shifting levers. And of course, you go by pushing the gas pedal. Where are the brakes? Who needs brakes when you're running over gremlins? Since there are two steering wheels, you can even compete against a friend. The gremlins will be out two at a time, going all over the place. Sometimes you have to almost predict which way they're going to go, and cut them off and run them over. Doing so, the gremlins turn into cross tombstones, causing your car to be stuck. Luckily, that shifter comes in handy when you get hung up on a gravestone or on a wall. You slam it in reverse and then into four to get unstuck. Probably my most favorite thing about Death Race is the loud shriek that the gremlins make when you run them over. It may be obnoxious to some, but I absolutely love it. The only safe spot for the gremlins is on the left and the right hand sides. Once the timer is out, the game is over. It's time to pop in another token and try again. Death Race always has me coming back more and more to top my own score. The random element of the gremlin movements make it fun and challenging every time I play it. This one is a tough one to find, so I definitely suggest checking out ACAM's beautiful Death Race. Beautiful and death probably shouldn't be in the same sentence. I know. Wait, the whole point of the game is to kill people? Yeah. 